This tutorial covers challenge one line in the FTC simulator. If you ever need a refresher on the steps, you can click the green logic board button and at the top, click guide to help yourself navigate. Hello everyone, my name is Tanish from Youth Culture and we'll be working with the FTC STEM movement lesson today. We also have Kostya here who will be working with the simulator. Hi everyone, I'll be running through the simulator as Tanish narrates. So first, we click the green logic board button on the left and before we select and add any block, it's important to click the zoom button on the right side of the logic board for better viewing. Now onto the blocks. On the left side, we can start by clicking actuators, then DC motor, and then dual. And we can select and drag the first motor block and bring it to our logic board. And we can now attach this block right under our purple simulator block. From here, we can adjust the values of our left and right motor. Our objective here is to have the robot move forward towards the flag. To do this, we'll have the left motor value to negative one and the right motor value to one. So let's click run to see what happens. Perfect, so we've completed challenge one. So just to add one more important thing, you should click save at the end of your challenge to make sure that you can save your code. So now that Tanish has run through the tutorial, I will give you my points of importance within this tutorial. For challenge one, our objective is to go straight towards the flag and we needed a motor block to, to achieve this. The first thing I have learned is to access the motor block and fix it on the logic board. The second thing I learned is making the left and right motor values the opposite, which is negative one and one to make the robot go straight. Thank you everyone for tuning in. Hope you have a great day. I hope you learned something as well. Bye now.